Hi friends and welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for dropping in for another Target haul. Target does it again. It's all about Valentine's Day. I think it's just a cute, fun, girly little holiday that the girl should be spoiled on. I mean, am I right girls? Yes. If you haven't subscribed though to my channel yet, please do subscribe and let's get right into some of these finds that I found. Well, Okay, as you can see, I did a little bit of damage and these bags are a little heavy. They might actually break. I don't know what to start with. There's just so many things. Okay, let's start with like the style things that I found while I was there on this visit. swimsuits out which here in Florida it's kind of like swimsuit season all year round so I guess it's not really like a big surprise to me but at the same time I wasn't expecting to see like a whole new like variety. The first one is like this adorable throwback bikini. I think this little bikini top is just so cute because it's totally like giving me 70s vibes. At least that's the decade I'm thinking this is. Love this mauve color. I think it's it's obviously just right up my alley. Hello. And this little cute little keyhole and the little bow right there in the middle. It is supported so it's like a full-on cup and it's under wire so that's awesome if you need support for the girls for me I just have a hard time kind of filling this out I got this in a 34 B that's typically my size these are the bottoms that match and they just have like the little tie detailing on this side and it's the old-school like ribbing as far as the material and the fabric and I just think it's really cute I, I got the pants in a medium I go between smalls and mediums because I got a booty and so usually when it's more of like a full coverage bottom like these I'll have the issue where they kind of like start to cut in and I hate that that's like one of my biggest pet peeves so I basically went a size up and I just tied the sides tighter that way I didn't get the funny like pooching and bagging in the front but then it covered my butt and it wasn't cutting in because the small was just a little too tight on like the cheeks everything else in the small fit fine but this is suit number one how cute and then I saw this adorable, how adorable is this one piece? I mean, the little ruffle detailing and then also I'm loving this dusty like bell blue. I just think it's so like Southern Belle and I just love it so much. I, I, call, I call colors dusty sometimes, like that mauve was kind of like a dusty mauve. Like, Weird, I know, but it's true. But anyways, I love that it has like the little V dip there and the ruffles go all the way over the shoulder and to the back side. And then the back has an awesome detail where it like crisscrosses at your upper back and then it ties together there at the middle, like right at your bra line to hold you in place. And then also there are like padded cups in here. It's not like cups like that first bikini, but there's definitely padding in there. And it's removable if you don't want the pads in there. But this swimsuit is more of like a high cut on my front side, but then it's kind of like medium coverage on the back side. And I got this one in a medium as well because I need the length for my torso, and then also I don't want it like doing that little cut in thing. These are from Sugar Fix, which is by Bobble Bar for Target. I just thought these were so adorable for springtime that'll be rolling around in no time, but it has this little petal flower with a little pearl on the middle and then just a gold little hoop. I know they had white because I was debating between the two, but 
pink one, my heart. And then they had black, and I want to say it was kind of like a navy-ish blue kind of flower, and that was really pretty too, but I was like, I want something that looks definitely like more valentine-y and spring. Like it'll just, these will go with like pretty much everything that I own. <laughs> Moving along to some, mm, let's do just fun things to use. I found this super, super pretty water bottle. So my boyfriend's gonna see this, he's gonna be like, Laura, I told you, you don't need any more water bottles. Throw the ones that you have away. I don't need as many as I have, but I have a new one. <laughs> this was oh so pretty because it fades from the perfect baby pink down to this like icy baby blue color. This is um, Simple Modern, which I haven't used before, but it's kind of like, the sweat bottles or cork sickle where basically it's insulated and it's stainless steel. It's also sweat free it says and it's BPA free. I've been trying to be good and drink more water throughout my day. Like I'll usually get one of these sizes down and then maybe like a half but it's like really I want to try to drink three of these babies. So. I'm gonna do my best and I'm gonna start this out. Maybe this new water bottle will be like the remedy to my water fix. And this is like a completely random find, but it was like on my way out walking just past like the kitchen supplies and utensils. I came across this beautiful, super girly and just so pretty little porcelain bowl. Do I need this? No, but at the same time, I take my lunch to work. I was like, this is a pretty decent sized bowl, like if I make a salad or something like that, because I honestly don't have like a to-go bowl. So this was like, I thought perfect. And then there was a really pretty rectangle one where it was blue and white, um, kind of like rosy old school pattern, like kind of country themed. And I just think they're so pretty. It says that it's microwave safe, dishwasher, oven. Obviously, just don't put the lid in the microwave or the oven. Now, I want to share some of those items that I found on the dollar spot. Like, right as you walk in, stuff just goes super fast. Like, I still found lots of cute things. <laughs> these adorable little pink heart lights. It just has that really cute kind of like doily looking pink heart and pink's obviously my fave. So I'm really glad this was the only set in the bin there. And I got my hands on it. So I don't really know what I'll do with them yet, but I'm sure I'll be able to find something. I need to like start getting onto my room and like getting it decorated. So I'm sure I'll find somewhere cute to place these. Also on the dollar spot, I found this ceramic mug. Now I just thought this was so pretty because it's like this matte blush color and then in gold, it's just wrote love right there. It's kind of actually more like rose gold um, metallic writing. I just thought it was so pretty. Again, I have a crap ton of mugs downstairs and I don't need another one. It's so much more fun to just drink your beverage of choice out of a themed mug. My last dollar spot find that I ended up purchasing was this candle. So they had three different options in these candles. I just think this little jar is oh so pretty because it's kind of like that spackled metallic, you know, I don't know, I love blush. They had a pink one, which was really pretty. The jar was pretty, but the scent, I didn't care for it. And then they had a gold one and the scent was vanilla and that smelled delicious, but I was like, I like this jar better. Bouquet of roses and it smells just like that, like a bunch of roses. So. This will just make my room smell oh so nice. We're talking about what y'all probably really are wanting to know and that's food. I love me some food and I always find such amazing new things to try while I'm at Target. Speaking of new is this vanilla almond butter. So if you guys watch my 2019 resolutions video, then you know that I have been starting to try to do like the whole carb cycling thing, watching my macros and like getting my butt back in the gym, which it's been working out. Thank you so much. But my body's dying and like the dieting is really 
what's the hardest for me. I've always been active, so it's like I feel good when I'm kicking my ass in the gym, but the food portion of it, it's like I go in and out from being like super healthy and just wanting to grab some pizza and munch down on it. The dieting and watching what I can eat, that's actually been very challenging for me and I can go into that more on another video. But almond butter has definitely been one of my go-tos recently because of that. I find that with almond butter, it just has a little bit, because I'm like a sweet gal, so well, I'm a sweet and salty gal, so it's a lose-lose situation for me. But the almond butter I find is just a little bit sweeter than peanut butter, and it has very little carbs, and it has a great amount of protein in there. I wanted to try this vanilla, which actually isn't that bad on the sugar level. It has a total of three grams of sugar per serving. So it just sounded yummy. It was on sale as well. It was like six bucks, I think. And usually almond butters are more expensive than that. More protein bars for you all. So if you haven't heard of Quest, Quest is a bar that I've had like for quite some time now. And I think I like overdid it back in my Rockette days eating them where I just like got completely sick of them. But there's new flavors out and at least new to me and I definitely have tried the birthday cake before and I thought they were delicious and so I'm going back to get me some more Quest but these were buy one get one half off at Target just the other day and I have one more food item that's kind of like a luxurious like treat for yourself but still like fitness themed and that would be Kodiak cakes so I'm sure you guys have heard me talk about these before but I absolutely love Kodiak cakes I think all of their flavors are absolutely amazing this one was on sale it was only two dollars and thirty four cents because it is the pumpkin flax I actually didn't see this during like fall and stuff like that so I didn't I haven't got to try this one yet but I love me some pumpkin I'm like I don't care if it's if fall is completely over and pumpkins out it's just like I don't care I'm gonna eat it but I think these sound delicious and I'm so excited to get them and honestly I was almost gonna buy more than one because it was so darn cheap but I was like try it out first and another yummy flavor that I actually have tried before and I think it's my top fave as of currently is the cinnamon oat. It has more of a hearty grain like yummy you're being good type feeling to it. I don't really know why it just that's what goes through my head when I'm eating them. They're just really yummy especially if you put berries especially raspberries if you put them on top of it like they're just oh so good. It's on my high carb day where I can have like an extra 100 grams of carbs. I'm going to be making these babies. So that wraps it up for this Target haul for now. I will be going back there and I'll be buying more things again. I hope you all enjoyed my fun finds. Oh, and one more thing. <laughs> I almost forgot to share like my most favorite item that I found at Target and it's this fluffy pink heart pillow. I just think it's so, so cute and she's so, so soft. I just love it so much. Okay, so I found this back in like the bedding and everything and they had this in this blush pink which, duh, I was like drawn to. They also had a like white kind of Sherpa, just like my sweater here, honestly. It just wasn't that soft, but it was like a fuzzy white heart pillow, and it was really pretty, but again, it just, it felt funny to me. They had one more heart-shaped pillow, and it was like gold sequin, where you rub it this way, it turned cream, and then you come back that way, and it was gold. The pink furry won me over. <laughs> I can't believe that I almost forgot to share that with you. It was just sitting right off to the side, not in a bag, and that's why I was just like, oh no! That is now everything Thing that I got at Target. If you enjoyed these things, please give this video a thumbs up. Also, subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to hit the bell. That way you are always notified every time I upload a video. I will have all of this stuff listed below for you to easily shop. And if you do decide to shop through those links, those are reward style links. So I do make a small commission. Other than that, I will see you all later with something else fun and exciting. Bye friends.